so we can go over here and park it comes. Oh shoot. Yo dude, come over here. Let me back up a little bit on the curb. Come on man. Alright, we got the passenger in the car. Let's take him to Serenity Wellness. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right scapes and graphics we're back in the building with another gta 5 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to be installing the uber driver this one has been revamped all right it has been picked up by chill that is our latest creator right here shout out to the creator when you get down to this download page what you want to do is scroll down and read the full description all right there's a lot of information including the change log in this description and the requirements all right so after you're done reading that full description what you want to do is come up here where it says all versions and you want to go to the current one and select the green arrow to download all right now let's go ahead and jump into the requirements as i mentioned before if you read the description the requirements are right here we are going to need lemon ui Scriptbook V and scriptbookv.net. All right, all those links will be that that will be linked down in the description, and we will be installing all of the requirements, including this mod as well. Okay, so make sure that you download or click on all of the links that are linked down in the description underneath requirements okay it's going to say requirements all right so everything underneath requirements make sure that you click on all those links and download all of them all right so once you have all of your requirements downloaded and you have your uber driver downloaded on my left hand side i have a few downloads i have lemon ui scriptbook v scriptbookv.net and i have uber driver all right and on my left hand side i mean on my right hand side i have my grand theft auto 5 directory opened up Let's go ahead and start installing our scriptbook V. Okay, so go ahead and open up the scriptbook V folder. Inside that folder is going to be another folder that says bin. Open up the bin folder. And we are going to take the dimput8 file and the scriptbook V file. Okay, just these two files I have highlighted. Drag and drop those right here into our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. I already have it as you can see. After that has been dragged and dropped, let's go back, back again, go to the next folder, which is scriptbookv.net, inside that folder, oops, inside that folder, we are going to be taking these files that I'm going to highlight, everything except the two text documents, all right, we're going to take all these files that I have highlighted except those first two, and we're going to drag and drop those right over here into our GTA 5 directory. Right. Once that has been dragged and dropped, what we need to do now is go inside of our scripts folder. So if you don't have a scripts folder, go ahead and create a new folder and name it scripts all in low caps. Once you have that opened up, I mean, once you have that created, go ahead and open it up. Now let's go back over to our downloads and now let's install our lemon UI first. Okay, let's get out the requirements first all right so let's go ahead and install lemon ui open the lemon ui folder inside the lemon ui folder there's going to be a few folders in here we are going to be focusing on this one right here okay the shvdn3 okay so open up that one inside that one we are going to have three files we're going to highlight all three files and we are going to drag and drop those to our scripts folder already have it after that is done let's press the back arrow press the back arrow again now let's go into our uber driver folder open up the uber driver folder inside the uber driver folder we are going to have our necessary files we are going to take everything inside the uber driver folder except the readme okay so the first initial uber driver folder we're going to highlight all four um all four 
files or products inside this folder except the readme we're going to deselect that one all right so you got the uber folder the uber driver folder and two uber driver uh, files right here we're going to take those three and we're going to drag and drop them right here in the scripts folder all right now um the uber driver does come with a configuration settings if you look right here and if you double click it um, it does have some keys that you can change. So just in case you have some other scripts or mods that are using uh, function key F6, then you can change it to a different function key, all right? Um, also, if you wanted to change the accept key and decline key as well. Once you have done that, go and, go and select file, select save, and you're all good to go. Now that we have that fully installed, let's go ahead and minimize any windows that we might have open and run the game. All right, once you spawn into the game, what you want to do is uh, get your hands on a car. Uh, for today's tutorial, I will be using an add-on car. So once you have chosen your car, go ahead and press Function Key F6. Once you press Function Key F6, this Uber driver menu will open up on the left side of the screen. And um, it's going to be the first option to start accepting rides. You want to go ahead and check that box. And then the next one is instant rides. I'm going to check that one also. Then you have the third option is to cancel the ride if you have um, accepted the ride already. Then you have the last one, the fourth option is settings. You could go in settings and you could um, adjust the drop off location to city or country. All right. And you also have the option to uh, put on a notification sound and you could go ahead and force a start ride. All right. So let's go ahead and uh, force one. Well, we didn't even have to force it. Once you have a uh, ride that pops up, it's going to pop up above the minimap. Press E to accept or T to decline. So this one we accepted and it's going to be an estimate, estimated payout of $196. Definitely know how to get to this one. Alright. And it should be, yep, there they go, right here. Right, so we picked up our passenger. Let's go ahead and drop them off. We have the location on the map. Alright, we are closer to the food market, to the destination where we have to drop off the passenger. Let's go ahead and run that red light. Once you uh, get to the marker, the marker's across the street. It's all right. Try to pull. You might not see the marker, but just pull into where you think it's at, and the car will stop. Passenger will get out, and above the mini map, you have your rating, your payout tips, and total payout, including the elapsed time. All right. And as you can see right there, uh, we're on level one. Progress until next level is one out of two. So let's go ahead and accept the next ride. So we can go over here, park it. Comes. Oh shoot. Yo dude, come over here. Let me back up a little bit on the curb. Come on man. Alright, we got the passenger in the car. Let's take him to Serenity Wellness. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. oh you're going to the, the new cookie store, huh? All right, so there we go. We got paid $208 for that, we got tipped $64. The regular payout was $184, but our total was $208. So when you're all done, um, we go ahead and decline those and take off these. And we won't be getting any more rides. That's right, folks. So, this is pretty cool that uh, somebody had uh, brought this back because I remember the original um, Uber script and everything and that was, that was pretty dope. So, for them to bring this back and have it updated is pretty cool also, yo. So, I'm going to go ahead and let my uh, driver just go ahead and drive around the city. We'll pick up some more passengers, but if this video helped y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like button for me. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with y'all friends that are in the modding GTA 5 y'all's games and graphics 
me and my MP character, we are out of here till next time, yo. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.